Hey everyone, Dylan here, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing a top five, my well, my top five least favorite exercises to do. And I will be putting a card, because um, I did a, a previous top five list video about the top my top five favorite exercises so i'll put another disclaimer like i did before these are just my top five exercises i just hate doing by no means am i saying they're bad or they're bad for building muscle or anything like that they're just my least favorites to do just for whatever reason for how i feel about them uh maybe i do things wrong but that's really about it um you know that's just kind of my disclaimer i'm not like a guru or anything about exercises but anyways uh i'll just get started so my number five least favorite exercise to do are deadlifts so um i know deadlifts are a good exercise to do and all that for a full body workout and stuff but man do i hate them to hate doing them sometimes like right now like um I'm, i went back to the basics because i like got injured and stopped working out for a while so right now i'm just doing like body weight exercises and stuff so i haven't been doing that like deadlifts and stuff or any like barbell exercises but uh like the thing i don't like about deadlifts are you the setup it's really annoying because you have to get set up you have to make sure you're doing it right do all the cues right and make sure you're doing it good and um not to mention just that they wear me the freaking heck out like um just doing like a set Cause like I tried to like, I've done many different types of like workout set, like routines and stuff, some to save time, some to do multi multiple things, but it's just like, it's really hard to do put like deadlifts in like a circuit. Like if you wanted to try to do supersets and you want to do deadlifts, like I'm dying when I do those. Um, or if you're trying to do a heavier weight of deadlifts, it's just like, it leaves you so freaking tired and maybe my conditioning just sucks and <laughs> that might be it but uh you know it's just kind of a pain to do sometimes like sometimes i'm okay with it but sometimes it's just like ah oh, man i gotta do deadlifts uh but i know deadlifts are great and they're good for all programs and stuff and all that but there's just a little bit to them and they're kind of tiring that's kind of why they're my like fifth least favorite exercise to do but uh yeah so next uh, my fourth least favorite exercise to do are pull-ups and if you watch the other video like huh uh wait what isn't pull-ups in your top five favorite exercises to do aren't you double dipping here and yes yes i am but <laughs> uh there is a reason for it i have a love-hate relationship with pull-ups um basically if you are not strong enough to do pull-ups it sucks like you feel so weak because you can't do pull-ups like you know if you can't even do like even half a pull-up you just you try your hardest but you just can't do it like you're not strong enough it's really demotivating and demoralizing it's like oh i gotta go do pull-ups which i can't do or i have to uh I have to make it easier or get like take off some of the resistance to it and uh it just really sucks so like in that regard i actually used to hate pull-ups and uh i still kind of dislike them because of how hard they are they're like just super hard to do and uh kind of, so depending on whether you can do them or not right <laughs> will like measure whether or not i like they're my most hated or like they're one of my favorites to do uh so yeah that's kind of like my feelings on like like the pull-up it's my fourth my least favorite exercise to do if you if i can't do them at all uh but uh yeah and now my number three is uh for my least favorite exercises is push-ups not because they're hard uh per se but for some reason I just hate getting down on the floor and doing push-ups. Like the the laziness and like, ugh, I gotta get on the floor and do push-ups. Like that part of it, like the push-up itself, like I don't like, like I don't love it, but I don't like, I don't like care for it either. But just getting down on the floor and getting my hands down and doing push-ups and then having to get up off of it, I just hate it. I don't know why. Like I can't explain why. I just hate it. I just hate getting down and doing push-ups. I just hate it. It just has this sense, like I said, of like, ugh, uh, like I have to get down on the floor. 
and I don't feel this, well, I feel slightly this way if I have to like do crunches and ab exercises or uh, do like a floor press exercise or whatever. I feel like that slightly a little bit, but not as strongly as I feel about getting down and doing push-ups. Like I said, can't really explain it. Just, I just hate the feeling I have when I do it. So like it's, it's a really strong feeling more than like my fourth and fifth least favorite exercises. And um, so yeah, that was my number three. So my least favorite second exercise is dips. I hate dips and maybe it's my own fault but no matter how I do dips, it never feels right. It always feels wrong. It feels uncomfortable. Sometimes I feel like I'm going to hurt my shoulders and maybe I'm doing it wrong. I've tried it on many different things. Like uh, when I did have sight and I lived somewhere else, I lived close to a gym that I could walk to. And I think I once uh, tried doing it with a captain's chair and it was diffi partially difficult, but it just didn't feel right. It felt bad on my shoulders. Uh, maybe I have jacked up shoulders. I don't have a good posture either. So uh, that might be part of it. But even when I did it like on a surface where my hands are just behind me and like my palms are on something and it's not in like that a dip station, this still didn't feel good. It didn't feel right. And to be honest, I like really just never did dips. I stopped doing dips. I hated how they felt. I maybe just couldn't do them right. Maybe my shoulders are jacked up. Something about it was off. Maybe it's all three, but I hate dips. I really do. I don't know. I just, I just do not like dips. Uh, very, very strong, very strong feelings about the dip. Maybe, and you know, I, maybe it's a great exercise, I guess, because people do do it and it works your chest and triceps, depending on how you do it and all that. Oh, but yeah. So my least favorite or least second favorite exercise is dips hate them no matter which way you try to do them hate them <laughs> and then my number one least favorite exercise is the barbell bent over row and um i don't particularly like the one arm dumbbell rows either i don't really care for those either but specifically i am talking about the bent over barbell row i hate it man i've gotten injured so many times on it and you're probably like well that's your own fault probably and you know what you are right it's probably my own fault either a um i just was too weak to uh typically what would happen is a muscle in my back or my like abs or something would get pulled and get hurt because i didn't have the strength to stay in the uh like in the um, uh, bent over position or even like slightly at an angle, right? I just did not have the strength to hold that uh, very good. And so it made them very difficult. But at the time I didn't have a pull-up bar or any way to do pull-ups or anything to try to work my lats out. So that was really my only way to get a good stretch. And I didn't really get a good feeling on doing just one arm dumbbell rows. I only got a good like a uh, good uh, mind muscle connection when I was doing a barbell row. However, I had really trouble with doing them to do a good weight, to do the form right, to keep the grip on the bar, to keep it straight, to pull it to where I needed to pull it, um, keeping my back straight. Um, it was just really difficult and I hated the setup. I hated everything about bent over barbell rows. And like I said, I got injured several times um, off doing them. So like I did eventually start to get better at them like because I did was start I started to get my core stronger and my lower back was starting to get stronger for me to stay in that position but I still hated them and hated the feeling because I felt like as I fatigued like my form went to like crap like when I was trying to just do the rows and it's just like uh like I just I just hate barbell rows like dumbbell barbell rows well I hate them but I hate all all well not all but I hated the one arm dumbbell rows and I hated the, like I said, uh, bent over barbell row. Whichever way you even tried to do it, I just hated it. Um, so yeah, and then depending on where you pulled, you know, you could work more of some of your muscles than others. And I don't know, it's just, it's my least favorite exercise that I can just, you know, spew about, I guess. But I'm not, like I said, I'm not saying these exercises are bad or anything. And like I said, maybe I've done them incorrectly or something's wrong or, you know, it's probably mostly just my fault uh, for most of these exercises. Mo any, most exercises are good as long as you do them correctly and all that. That's really the truth about it. Um, but uh, yeah, so 
That has been my top five least favorite exercises to do. Uh, let me know down in the comments what your least favorite exercises are to do. And like if, if any of mine like relate to you, if you like feel the same way I do about any, I'd be really curious to know like how you feel about some of these exercises. Um, if you feel the same way or anything like that. But uh, yeah, so that has been my video for today. Thank you guys for watching and thank you guys for listening. I will see you guys in the next video.